what's up YouTube it's your boy coach DRC and today we are working on the SR10 the associated oval car so I've made some slight changes to it um, based off of my first run that I that y'all saw me do at the track and I would move the left side shocks the position I moved them to the inside, which was something that I was told to do. So now what I'm going to do is make the oil change in the shocks themselves, which is also something that I was told to do, which is I'm going to go heavier in the front, lighter in the rear, which should help the car in the corners. So make sure I have all my stuff. Don't know how long this video is gonna be. If I don't have that much battery on my GoPro. So I'm gonna get in what I can get in. No, I haven't been posting in a while, but I'm in coaching season right now, so it's work, coach, meets, and then home with the family. So YouTube takes a a back seat to that right now. But appreciate everybody for sticking around and Staying tuned in to your boy. All right, so we're gonna get this, gonna get this shot broke down, and we'll be right back. All right, so we're back. I was gonna use forty weight shock oil, but that still seemed a little bit thin. So we're gonna go with diff fluid instead. And then you want to move that shock shaft up and down to get rid of the air bubbles inside the shock. Most people would put it in like a shock stand, which I have my car stand, which is also a shock stand. Just let it sit. But so yeah, we're gonna use a little bit of. Don't mind my my station. Uh, let's get this diff fluid. Nope, wrong one. There we go. So yeah, we're just changing the dip, the shock fluid. Sorry. right side of the car only leaving the left side as it is yeah there we go that's a lot better a lot better Let's get these air bubbles out I don't know if you guys can you guys can see them not many but you just don't want any air in there. So you just want to work the shock shaft up and down. But, so yeah, guys, I know I haven't been posting a lot lately, but when I'm in season, I tend to not really focus myself on YouTube as far as posting videos and stuff like that. It's work, practice, work, meets, home, family, and that's about it. But I'll get back to posting regularly here uh, in a little while. So appreciate you guys for still sticking around and and subscribe to your boy but I'm gonna go ahead and finish doing these shocks get these back buttoned up and then I'll come back and let you guys see what the body and the chassis looks like with the changes that I made on the adjustments as far as moving the position of the shocks on the rear and the front tower to the inner position which helps the car in the corners when it comes to oval so all right, guys, we're going to button this back up, and we'll be right back. Okay, guys, so we're going to go ahead and close this video out, but as I was trying to explain to you, so as you can see, the slight angle, how the car is sitting right now, you really can't tell from the back side, so let me flip it around so you can see it better. Okay, so now you can look at it a little bit better. So as you can see, the left side of the car is angled down, 
the right side of the car still sitting up as we all know oval left turn left turn so by moving the shock position on the left side of the car to the most inner point on the shock tower is going to help the car to dive into the turn and not push to the outside as much if i'm explaining that wrong jb trickle you can help me out y'all can go over sub to his channel as well for a lot of oval content but that's how i took it how it was explained to me that day i took it out to test it at the track but track is opening here soon at the end of the month so i'm trying to get this thing ready did change the shock oil in the front left the rear alone for now um, until i get it back out testing again so it's your boy coach drc don't forget to hit the like button don't forget to comment subscribe if you haven't already be ready for some oval content coming soon also some rc drl drag racing at the end of the month